King's Indian defense, Alec Hein anti-Grunfeld variation. Intense that was a serious game. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. Both players navigated the middle game well. Both players missed some big chances in the end game. Opening with the Queen's Pawn. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. By taking control of the crucial d5 square and creating a space on which the knight can move to c3 without obstructing the c-pawn, move c4 helps to create a strong center. With the help of the king's Indian defense, white can get ready to develop the bishop to g7 and create a powerful center that black will later try to damage. F3 weakens white's kingside and the e3 square while preparing the e4 pawn advance and removing the g4 square from black. By positioning the bishop on a potent diagonal, this fianchettos the bishop. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. The bishop is prepared to grow into a functional square. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. It is the final book action. This hits in the middle and prevents the opponent from gaining ground. That's good. By growing a queen from its beginning square, this activates the queen. That's good. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. It is quite good. This misses a chance to trample a knight. It is incorrect. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is ideal. That's an unfortunate error. It is a mistake. The knight can now control more squares as a result. It is quite good. This mobilizes the knight, allowing it to control more of the board. It is best. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. It is quite good. This provides an equal exchange of parts. It is ideal. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. That's good. This exchange is fair. It is quite good. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This is an equal trade. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. That's good. Making the adversary double their pawns makes it easier to establish flaws. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. It is quite good. This defends the pawn that was attacked. It is ideal. That's fine. It is good. A solid choice. It is excellent. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is good. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. It is quite good. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. It is excellent. Among the best actions. It is quite good. That's a decent move. That's good. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. A very strong play. It is excellent. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. That's fine. It is good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. That's a decent move. That's good. That is a logical response. It is quite good. Very precise. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. That's fine. 
It is good. This misses a chance to kick the rook. It is incorrect. The game was close to balanced, but now black is worse. It is a mistake. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. It is quite good. Although white had had the upper hand, the game is now almost even. It is incorrect. As a result, the bishop may now control more squares because it is in a better position. It is ideal. This exchange is fair. That's good. Backs off. It is ideal. On the file, the rooks are strategically doubled and forcefully combined. It is ideal. Although the score was nearly equal, white now has the upper hand. It is incorrect. Although white lost their edge, the game is still almost evenly matched. It is incorrect. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. That's a decent move. That's good. This places a rook on the seventh rank, activating it and putting the other side's king under pressure. It is ideal. The game was close to balanced, but now black is worse. It is a mistake. There was only one good move in that position. This ignores an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a miss. There was only one move that was effective, and this wasn't it. It falls flat. That's fine. It is good. This releases a pin, allowing a pawn to offer crucial defense. That's good. This is the start of the end game and white is winning. It is best. This captures a pawn and eliminates a danger. It is ideal. This shifts the bishop to a square with more activity, giving it greater scope. That's good. This ignores a superior strategy for protecting a pawn that was being attacked. It is incorrect. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a rook. This allows the opponent to challenge the opposing rook for the open file. It is a miss. This gives away a free rook. There was only one good move there. This overlooks an opportunity to challenge the opposing rook for the open file. It is a blunder. That was a free rook. It is best. Intense that was a serious game. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. Both players navigated the middle game well. Both players missed some big chances in the end game.